Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So it seems that Microsoft could be thinking of introducing a new page settings menu um, on the new tab page to be able to customize the new tab page in Microsoft Edge. Because today when I opened up Microsoft Edge 125, which is the latest Canary preview version, I noticed a new page settings dialog and menu. Um, that seems to be on a controlled rollout because I'm only seeing it in Edge Canary on my Windows 10 device and not my Windows 11 device. And this is common for Microsoft to push out brand new features they start testing using a phased approach. Now, just to give you a quick comparison, if we head over to Microsoft Edge 123, which is the latest release, the stable release, here we can see the so-called normal or older page settings dialog and menu. So this is how the page settings now have been for quite some time and you can see obviously a distinct difference. So if we head back to Edge Canary, we can see that things are looking a little bit more um, material U for want of a better word, fluent and a little bit more modern. Now I personally do like the new look. I think it brings a lot less clutter. I think it categorizes everything into its different um, so-called menus and compartments. And I personally like the content section. Now, I have also noticed, though, that although the menu has been visually redesigned, there are no new features that have been added to the actual menu. They've just reconfigured and um, redesigned the layout of the actual menu, which I actually quite enjoy. Now, here we can see our region and language at the top. You get your quick links. You can turn those uh, promotional links on and off. And this is the part I like. I think the content now with the actual thumbnail gives you a visual representation of what each content layout um, can look like. And I actually think this is a nice move in the right direction. And if you want to pop that content off, you just obviously pop that off. And if you want it back on, there we go. So everything works exactly the same. It's just a bit of a visual redesign and layout change. And then you get your edit background, which takes us over to um, editing your actual background. Nothing here has changed, still exactly the same. And then we get show weather, which obviously means you can toggle your weather widget and icon on and off on the new tab page. And this is also more now in line with the rest of the dialogues and menus. So as an example, if we head to favorites, you can see it's got a much darker user interface. If we head to our browser essentials, very similar, the look and feel, a much darker UI and user interface. So obviously now Microsoft is trying to integrate the page settings now um, to take on the look and feel of some other components that they have been upgrading when it comes to the user interface. So I'm going to keep a close eye on this one. And if and when this does make it to stable, obviously I'll let you know. And personally, I actually think I like this new layout. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.